Hello and welcome to Credit B Presents Bold Diaries. The second season after a mega auction is always interesting. Interesting for the fact that it uh, gives you an opportunity to actually measure yourself in terms of uh, how your team selection was in the mega auction itself. And uh, that's where I felt that the kind of preparation that uh, the management and the support group had kept put in in terms of uh, identifying players, sort of putting up a combination, uh, how to have that uh, overseas and domestic player mix uh, becomes extremely critical. Uh, for us, we have vindicated in the fact that having retained 18 out of those 23 players that we had last season means that uh, uh, a bulk of the work which was done in the mega auction was uh, uh, pretty spot on and it, uh, it needed continuation because uh, Consistency is something that uh, we are very big on and having identified a core group of, group of players and helping them to develop uh, around the year has been our endeavor even after the end of IPL season last year. So yes, we had to release unfortunately a couple of our players, uh, CV Milin, Anishwar and uh, uh, Lavnit Sisodia because these are domestic players. Uh, I'm pretty sure that the kind of exposure that they got last season traveling with the team, training with the team, uh, their interactions with overseas and uh, international players, Indian international players would have certainly helped them quite a bit. Our best wishes to them and uh, uh, we will be keeping an eye on them. Hopefully they go on and use this experience in domestic cricket and put up uh, bigger performances. Uh, for them to you know progress in their in their careers as well uh, two overseas releases uh, uh, jason obviously was traded to mumbai indians primarily for the reason that uh, hazelwood is going to be available for the bulk of the season and jason uh, would certainly would have uh, uh, wanted or he was extremely keen to be part of uh, a playing 11 and that's where uh, the opportunities at rcb were always going to be limited so that was the thought process behind Jason Berendorf's uh, release and as far as Sherfin Rutherford was concerned, uh, he got his opportunities, uh, we were tracking his progress and uh, uh, obviously uh, the Maxwell injury and the kind of cover that we would ideally want for Glenn Maxwell or even for that all-rounders role will mean that uh, probably uh, it would have been hard for us to foresee Sherfin Rutherford playing in the 11. So that was the entire thought process. Uh, Again, uh, uh, we believe in this team, we believe in the players that we have, uh, we're putting in a lot of efforts in their preparation and uh, I'm pretty confident that uh, the results will come our way. Thank you very much. This is Credit B Presents Old Diaries.